the speaker has made his ruling today i respect his ruling but again he says that uh, my grounds are okay but the only thing that i didn't do was to to attach the evidence i have a lot of evidence here against uh, cs masharia and this evidence were to be tabled in the floor of the house if indeed he really wanted this evidence they could have asked for it because i could have given it to them but it seems that they used it as a, bar, as, a, as a bait so that they can pull out of this motion. I'm going to do a letter. I'm going to attach all this evidence and give it to him. But my question is, even if I attach this evidence to him and give it to him, will he understand what is in the evidence? He needs somebody who will tell him, this is what I meant by saying A, B, C, D. So, yes, this was meant for the floor of the house, but it is said that standing order allows uh, evidence to be attached. We shall attach today. And give it to him today and see now if there will be any other reason to to deny me the opportunity to 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 impeach the cs uh, for transport uh, mr james masharia tomorrow i'm going to call to call for a press briefing uh it seems that nothing works in this country uh, the judiciary when they when they give out a ruling no one follows parliament same thing Senate, same thing. Uh, it seems that this is a, it's like a small Colombia where people feel that they can do what they want but not what the majority wants. So because they don't want us to take this motion to Parliament, we will take this motion to the public court and we are going to give out the names of everybody who has been behind this mess of SDR. Everybody who has benefited and what they have done. So tomorrow at 10 o'clock, God willing, I will share all this with the media, with the public, and we shall crucify them in the public court. What next after this? What next after this? I'm going back to Mombasa to my people.